Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm Jana, this is your Vintage Beauties, and we do, we'll do jar today. A real jar. I see a lot of cool stuff in it. Lapis, I think, right here. Right over here. Something with kind of like a coin stuff. This one, I do believe, is silver looks like it all right let's get going if you like anything in this video please email me at your vintage at gmail.com my email is always in the description box um to this video so it's always there all right while i'm opening it take a second to subscribe or check if your subscription is valid and still there because sometimes happens that subscriptions or I don't know unsubscribe double check if you have not done it so please subscribe and we will be family I'm afraid I don't want to cut anything let's see what we have here Here we go. First pour. Let's see. Right here is a brooch. I don't know what is all this. Little brooch. This is kind of a pearl heart. Okay. Of course, I dropped it as usual. There we go your rings right here I think came out brochy okay one more all right let's take a look gold to tone brooch three coins kind of I don't see any name it's a C closure yeah, no names. Okay, cute. Um, adjustable ring, silver tone with blue rhinestones. It, as of as it is, it's uh, seven size seven. Gold tone band with rhinestones, size six. Silver tone with a tiny rhinestone, five and a quarter. Stretchy ring with rhinestones, one right here, tiny one is missing. And another stretchy ring with different rhinestones right here. The pastel green, pink, and blue. Without any, it can stretch us to like to nine, but the smallest one without any stretch is two. Okay. I thought it was silver. I don't see any markings. Okay, so we have a necklace right here with natural stones. This looked like silver closure, but I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. It's too, too 
too ch cheapy. Tag says. Tag says. Cannot call. Right here. Cannot call. Uh, we have a um, presidium. Some highlights, some jaspers, probably. This one, I don't know what it is. Maybe wood colored. Silver tone. It does have an extender, so why this does not want to oh, another ring? Why it doesn't want to concentrate on my stuff? It is 18, I would assume, without yeah, 18 without any extenders and 3 inch extender. Yeah, some natural stones and wood. Okay, 18 without an extender and 3 inch extender. Cannot call necklace. Gold tone twisty ring, size seven and a half. This one's pretty bracelet. Very clean silver tone with rhinestones. All rhinestones are here. Fold over clasp. Clasp is really clean, no scratches. I don't see any names or any tags. It's pretty. Pretty rhinestone. Rhinestones, pretty um, bracelet. The size is six and three quarters. Okay. Size and three, six and three quarters. Right here we have a strand, a single strand. Uh, right here um, we have a kind of um, hidden closure. Let's see if I have any. Anything on this on the back. I don't see any. No, I don't see any markings at all. But right here we have a hidden closure. It is, um, these are glass beads. They're faux pearls. Um, I can't even say they're glass, but it, I'm always, it's kind of a little bit preceding, a little bit jerks towards the glass, but doesn't really... doesn't really go there the strand is oh it's it's really long let's do like this sixty four I think I think it's sixty four let's see No, it's 58, 58, right here, 58 for pearls, does have a little bit of weight to it, very good condition. Right here we have another ring, a gold town ring, size seven and a half, this one's really nice. They're clean, you know, 58, 
kind of a you can put few times around and there kind of two rings. Okay. Right here we have a bracelet with square shells. They're on the pink side. Barrel clasp. Oh my goodness, you're snoring. Um, Logan sits under my feet and sighs because I didn't pick them up. Okay, come on. Okay. Here on the pink kind of side, size 7 on the bracelet. Gold tone bracelet with faux pearls, a lobster claw, it says Napier. Here it says Napier. No extender. 16, size 16. Another stretchy bracelet. Um, These are glass beads, faceted, pinkish, kind of on the orange side. This one's a plastic. And then we have a one rhinestone right here as a charm, also glass. Seven. Okay. Who was watching, um, well, you're going to see this video on Tuesday, but I was wondering who was watching Eclipse on Monday. I'm in San Diego. We didn't really kind of, it was maybe a tiny bit dim, but not too much. All right. Uh, we have silver tone bracelet. It is toggle clasp, and there is one charm it says tr on it it's magnetic bracelet is size six bracelet is not magnetic <laughs> the charm is but i, I think it's silver tone Yeah, it's silver tone. Okay. Uh, first, let's take a look at this brooch. Silver tone brooch with the blue rhinestone in the middle. I don't see any signs between, be, um, besides, no, I think it's just a scratch. I don't see any stamps on this one. It looks like a snowflake. Okay, now we have a bib style necklace with beautiful flowers. There's some of them enameled. Some are like 3D. Looks like all the rhinestones are here. Silver tone chain with a with an extender. Without an extender, it's 16. An extender, another two and a half, three, three. Nice bib style necklace. All right, here is another brooch, gold tone bunny rabbit with a faux pearl, but, um, faux pearl tail and a pink nose open. No tags. That's cuteness. Such cuteness, bunny rabbit. Necklace. Lavender or lilac beads. Acrylic beads right here. We have barrel clasp, gold tone closure, and gold tone beads in between. Some of these are frosted, some clear. It's a very pretty lilac color. Let's measure. 17 inches. 
necklace. Cute. Oh, this looks like glass necklace. It's heavy. The beads are smoky. And we have rhinestone barrel clasp closure. With, uh, yeah. At first I thought it was magnetic, but no, it's rhinestones. Okay, let's double check. What do we have here? Glass. And this one is onyx. So we have glass beads and this pendant is onyx. No extension. The length is 18 inches. Okay. Next necklace, silver tone. The closure is spring closure. And we have wooden beads. The size of this necklace is 16 silver tone and wooden beads, 16 inches. Three-stranded necklace on the wire, gunmetal color, no tags, lobster claw closure, strands are layered, we have some faux pearls and a cherry kind of wine color, and some beads with rhinestones. The shortest laying, uh, layer is 17 inches, then we have 18 and 20, and 3 inch extender. Let's take a look at this one. Yeah, this is this is um, coral. Huh? I don't see. I don't see, guys. No stamps that it might be silver. It might be alpaca. For all we know. No, not at all. No stamps. <coughs> All right, let's let's test. Kind of sounds. I don't think so. And right here we have necklace chain itself. Okay. Um, probably need to open a new one. See, the new ones are brighter than the old brown one, so I'm just gonna open a new one. Okay, let's see. Hmm, looks like it's silver, guys. Yeah, see, red, very red. And what about the chain? And the chain red, too. So it looks like it's silver. Let me test my old one, this one, that I'm about to throw away. Let me see if it's still good. It seems like it's uh, yeah it's still good it's still good I can keep it for a little bit for today okay so it is silver it's probably 
I don't know. It's probably done by artists and they didn't stamp it. You know, maybe some native. But both um, chain and the pendant is silver and this is coral. Let me give you the length of this necklace. Eighteen inches. Okay, this necklace is eighteen inches. Let's take a look at this one. This is Madewell necklace, a gold tone with just this circle pendant with some ridges all around. Right here we have a Madewell tag, an M right here. Madewell tag it does have a couple of extenders couple length you can go the shortest one is 16 and a uh, three inch extender and there is like inch and a half in between you can okay made well right here we have a clip-on earring with shell pink shell just one um, put it aside okay this chain is very thick this one is Liz, Liz Claiborne it's tied up right here Okay, so there is a chain, pretty thick, kind of um, a rolled chain. And right here we have a pendant. It's just a silver tone tassel from chain. I'm not sure if we can undo it. No, we can't. It's connected. Yeah, it's connected. Okay, so the length of this necklace is 30 inches and 2 inch extender. Liz Claiborne, very pretty silver tone necklace. Next we have Pisces necklace again. We've had like this one before, gold tone. There are a little bit of wear on a gold tone, size 18 and inch and a half extender. Or gold tone Pisces. Some things right here that I don't know has wear on this side. On the side on this side of the oh this also made well but this necklace has too much wear especially on the pendant on this side okay so I'm gonna put this made well necklace in craft right here we have another necklace couple actually no, three neck oh, not ne uh, rings 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 guys okay so gold tone band with rhinestones size five and a half gold tone with this thing i don't know what like a pill looking thing also size five gold tone and right here gold tone kind of a hammered flat with a clear rhinestone size seven Next, we have a froggy. Necklace. So, gunmetal color. Right here, we have a froggy. She has, like, blue beads. One is missing right here. I will see if I can find it. I thought it was it, but it is not. It's just a blue rhinestone. Um... I think I can find it. It's really pretty. She is silver tone and she has silver tone chain. All right, let me measure. 24, no extender, froggy pendant, necklace. Uh, this reminds me of um, Jewel Cade. 
this kind of a pendant. I'm not quite sure if it is because a jewel Kate usually stamps his hers. Um, okay, let me measure bolt chain 23 inches. Here's a closure 23 inches with this pendant butterfly and music notes or moth. Okay, silver tone necklace, um, nice silver tone chain with extender and right here we have acrylic pendant on one side we have a picture very peaceful next to the water on the other side it says those we love don't go away they walk beside us every day unseen unheard but always near still loved still missed and very dear oh very sweet very sweet necklace. Okay, let me measure the chain. Chain is very clean and bright and nice. 18 inches and extender is another two. Very pretty. Silver tone. Silver tone links. Some are textured, some are not. Different size. Lobster claw. No extender, no name, but in very good condition. 34 inches necklace. All right, next pool. Just a chain. A little bit of ASMR for you guys. Another ring. Okay. Gold tone necklace. Very bright yellow gold tone. Magnetic as you can see. Bib style. Oh, gorgeous. Okay, what happened here? Oh, this one broke. It's supposed to be attached. Right here, it's supposed to be attached. Oh. There is no thing to hold it, unfortunately. Well, other than that, it's very pretty. It's, it's you know, it's in good condition, but I'm going to have to put it in craft because it's broken right here. And it's not attached. Okay. But to be honest with you, if I just cut this one off, it doesn't really have to be attached because if you attach it, it's going to be too, too close, like this, you know, like too close. I can just cut this off completely with my pliers and that's it, and like it never happened. Shall I just do it? Let me see. Don't do it, girl. Don't do it. I did it. I did it, guys. Look, I just cut it off. And that's it. Now it looks like it, it's been like this before. It, bore, it was born like this. Look. I think it looks way better because there, there are like equal parts right here. Otherwise, it would be like this. Look at this. It looks way better like this. I love it. Way better. Perfect. It's fantastic. Gold tone, rhinestones are here. All the rhinestones, all the cabochons with these ones are here. And it is on three chains. It has an extender. It is 18 inches and it's three inch extender. All the evidence perfect look at it perfect gorgeousness right here is next also necklace it is Stella and dot okay nice Stella and dot very muted gold tone 
with some faux pearls. Yeah, faux pearls and beads, and they have some like spikes right here. Okay, so. Yeah, that plastic beads. Okay, and spikes. It does have an extender. The size of this is 16 and two inch extender. The little spikes right here with rhinestones. Stella and Dot. This one's cool necklace. But this is not, this is not turquoise. This is something colored right here. I can see it. I can see it was colored stone. I don't know what type of stone it is, but it is colored. It is natural, though. Yeah, registers as uh, Jedi family. And this one is, um, well, see this one strand. If you guys want to make it few strands, you can just open this. Okay, and just close it and make your necklace shorter. It's kind of like a necklace adjuster, okay? Like this. Very pretty. So the strand is... Let me open. The strand itself is 34 inches. Okay. 34 inches. And right here I will attach this accessory so you can make necklace longer or shorter or decorate it the way you want to okay this is pretty necklace oh wow this is really pretty let me do this so this is oh this is chico's um, it's a kind of a muted gold tone there's a little bit of wear over here on this side let me make it as short as possible and then we measure the extender. Okay, so what happens here? Right here we have a velvety um, str uh, strand. No, what do you call it? Why my words? Every time I click record, the words are just disappear from my head. Lace, I think. And then it comes to a V. And after it comes to V, we have very, very, very long drop. Very cool. These are very dark blue. Unfortunately, it's acrylic, I think. Yeah, unfortunately, I think it's acrylic. Hold on. Yeah, it's acrylic. It's very pretty blue, very pretty, but it is acrylic, unfortunately. Okay, so let me measure the necklace. It is 15 inches without an extender. Extender is four inches and a drop after a V is six, oh, eight inches, eight inches. So it's very cool, very cool. And the color is amazing. Okay, Chico's right here. Another uh, stretchy ring gold tone with rhinestones here. Uh, right here we have a gold tone necklace with extender lobster claw closure. And right here we have a little pendant. Let's see what this is. I don't know, some type of triangle. And the chain is in front of it. Like right here, see there's a chain. Kind of like this, yeah. All right, the size of this necklace is, probably need to move it to the center. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here 
There we go. 16 inches, 3 inch extender. Oh, this is gorgeous. We have pearls right here, and we have, oh, look at this. This is gorgeous. Hopefully it's glass. Glass, okay. Yep, glass. And then we have different pearls. They are real pearls. Yeah, real pearls. Then we have this bicone glass beads. And is this silver? This is silver closure. Right there. Right there it says 925. We have silver closure right on. Very nice necklace. Okay, very nice. I think it's 20, hold on. No, no it's not. It's 18, 18 inches, no extender. This is glass, look how pretty this is. Kind of a amber, um, amberina color, orange. All right, let's take a look at this one. Very bright gold tone necklace. It is, oh, it looks like a um, bolo tie necklace. It has a closure right here. Can you move? Yeah, it moves. You can make it shorter, longer. Let's see what it says right here on the back, if we'll be able to read it. It says... I don't know. I see the letters, but I, I, I can't make it out. It says uh, P. Or B. Patent. It, it, there is a patent number, but I can't figure out what says right here. See the letters? Right there, letters P Z upside down. I don't know. Like like this. Do you guys know what it is? So right here, I think it's a flower. Like a collar, maybe flower. I'm not sure if anything's supposed to be here. Right here. I am gonna. I am gonna. Lens look it up and see if there's support doesn't look like anything supposed to be right here in the middle It doesn't feel like anything is missing But it's very pretty and you can make it shorter longer. So I'm not gonna it's a bolo tie. I'm not gonna like measure it It's really pretty It's magnetic. Yeah Okay, next another necklace Silver tone with extender. Then we have this plastic cabochons, pink and orange ones on the hammered gold tone discs. Here is the back, here is the front. No name or any other tags. Uh, I would say 18, uh, 17, 18 inches and 3 inch extender. Okay. Uh, this one's interesting. Silver tone chain. Slightly magnetic. And we have this pendant with a rhinestone. The rhinestone is, I think, CZ. I'm not sure if anything is on the back. Yeah, it says 
CZ China. Yeah, it says something. CZ China and something else. Right there. So here's a pendant. It's very pretty. Now let's measure it. Silver tone chain. 18 and inch and a half extender. Okay. Here's a necklace of silver tone and red chains. Multi stranded. Hold on. multi-stranded, um, tied in a knot, and then we have a tassel right here, all kind of like the end. Pretty cool, great, um, great condition, silver tone lobster closure and extender. The length of the necklace is 22 and then we have two and a half extender right here we have a bracelet with pearls it was gold tone it reminds me of Indian hinge bracelet so you pull this one out you kind of un open it Like this, unscrew it, you can open it, put it back, but we have a lot of gold tone wear right here. Um, but it is look, uh, it does look like an Indian bracelet. This one's a real pearls and some red beads, maybe, maybe coral, but I don't think so. Okay, the size of this bracelet is seven and a quarter. Just keep in mind, it does have gold tone wear on it. Gold tone, um, this is just a gunmetal color chain. I'll put it aside and see if we're missing, um, if it's missing its pendant. Right here, we have a penguin gold tone. Does have a weight to it. He's a solid penguin on a gold tone chain with extender lobster claw closure. The penguin is not magnetic, but he is gold to tone. Okay. Sixteen inch necklace, two and a half extender, and a little tiny gold tone penguin pendant. All right, moving right along to this one. Also multi stranded. Looks like three strands. Looks like three strands. They're layered. We have this silver tone colored beads and discs without an extender. Shorter length is 16, longer 20, middle um, 18, and two and a half inch extender. Okay, more. we'll finish today it's gonna to be a little bit over an hour but still okay oh this gorgeousness look at this gorgeousness silver tone with rhinestones and faux pearls looks like everything in place um this is just i don't know where extender starts or begins so i'm gonna measure the whole length okay i'm gonna measure the whole length it is the longest you can have it is nine, um, 19 inches. Okay, it's uh, the longest that you can have it, 19. It's really pretty, really pretty. Look at this. Really pretty. 
pretty. Silver to necklace. Right here we have a natural stone necklace. We have some jasper and maybe onyx and it does not have an extender. It has a pull um, taggle actually closure. The length of this necklace is 18 inches and this stone is about an inch. On the presidium it measures in the tourmaline line. I don't know what this is guys, honestly. Okay. Oh this one's cool. Oh this one's really cool. It's heavy. Let me let me see what these are. They go to Jedi. This is glass. Yeah. These gray ones go to Jedi and these ones are glass. Uh, do we have a closure? No, we don't have a closure. It's just a um, strand. Not magnetic. Let me... Let me test the chain. Oh, interesting. Might be silver. Interesting. Let's use my old one. Since we decided it's working. It's silver, guys. Chain is silver. I can show you right here. See this red coloring? Yeah, it's silver. That's nice. Love it. I don't know who cut this white one, but no. Okay. So we have a just one strand, no closure. We have glass beads, then it comes to this gray beads, and it comes this to the like kind of a to a V. Okay. The whole necklace is 34 inches. The whole thing. The stones are heavy. Nice. Oh, look at this. Look at this dolphin. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, wow. Is this silver? It looks like it's silver, but I don't know. Does it need to be cleaned or polished or something happened to it? Right there, see, we have like a silver stamp. I don't know what happened. Maybe it was gold tone at some point. I have no idea. But right here we have a natural stone kind of a leaf carved. And right here we have a dolphin. So we have some kind of quartz. Dolphin is amethyst line quartz. And then we have, yeah, we have different color quartz here. Whatever stones are in the quartz family. It's so pretty. There are leaves. Yeah, so cute. Okay. Oh, the 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 length. Yeah, the length because it doesn't have an extender. 18 inches. 18 inches. Poku shell, very nice poku shell necklace, white. 16 inches. Let's see. Yeah, 16 inches. Glass necklace with gold tone toggle clasp closure. Yes, all glass. This one's kind of art glass with black and yellow. 18 inches. Let's take a look at this one. Gold tone. I think this one's also acrylic. Yeah, acrylic. Mm -hmm. Gold tone necklace. We do have an extender. No name, no tags. Okay. Let's see. 16 inches, three and a half, three inch extender. 
This glass is not glass. This acrylic is black. Mm -hmm. There's another interesting necklace. Might be glass or something else. So we have a very pretty box closure. I think it's gold filled. Let's double check on the side right here. Yeah, 120th, 14, 14 karat gold field. Yeah, gold field. Okay. It's a very pretty box closure. Let's close it. Here we go. Nice. Let's see what we have here. These faceted beads are glass. They are knotted in between. And right here we have a faceted heart. Also glass. Well, it might be onyx because it's in the glass family, right? Pretty. Has some nice weight to it. It is 21 inch necklace. Prettiness, another glass necklace like candies. Right here we have a closure. There is nothing on it. Gold tone closure and um, pastel pink red glass beads. Okay. The length of this necklace is 24. What is this? Uh, no name, fold over clasp necklace with this pendant. Some of the, all the rhinestones are here, but some of them are kind of yellowish. Yeah, here is the back. I also do not see any uh, tags or any names. It's short. It is short. It is... Ooh, 14 inches. Let's double check. 15 maybe. Let me measure. No, it's actually 16. It's 16, guys. Because I couldn't really measure it like this. 16 inches. Not too bad. Silver tone necklace. Okay, seed bead necklace. Twisted. Iridescent seed beads. Um, button. Probably like a coconut or some nut button. Toggle clasp. 18 inches. Oh, this one is too stranded, I think. Yeah, two strand, two stranded. No, one stranded. Gold tone chain with gold tone square beads and the pendant. It's natural, but it is colored. I think howlite. Okay, lobster claw. Not in the greatest condition. I see some gold on wear. It's 36 inches length. No name or anything. Uh, right here we have a bracelet. Also no name. Toggle clasp. This one's kind of like brutalist industrial chain. It's solid. It has weight. It's not magnetic. I don't see any stamps. This is not silver. Might be plated, but I'm gonna sell it as non-silver. Like I said, it does have some weight to it, size six and a half. Six and a half. 
A uh, silver tone chain with, is it silver tone? Yeah, silver tone chain. Okay, with a little angel right here as a pendant. I thought it was silver, but it is not. 18, 18 inches. I can I can try to test, but yeah, it's not silver. Okay, silver tone chain with um, this type of lobster claw, and right here we have a little angel in 18 inches. Gold tone chain with um, zodiac sign. I don't know who this is with rhinestones if I'll be able to test rhinestones they are CZs these rhinestones um let's take a look I think it says 925 so we have a vermeil here yeah it's 925 gold uh, plated Verme necklace with a zodiac sign. It has a tiny extender. Without an extender, it is 16 and a half an inch extender. Okay, silver verme. Anything on the back? Yeah, right here is also silver. It says 925 right there on top. So very nice. And the rhinestones are CZ's cubic zirconia. Yeah. Okay, pretty. Seed bead necklace, multi-stranded, chunky with different colors, green, kind of lemony, lime color, clear and blue, no extender, we have a um, hook closure, and it is 16 inches, 16 inches, nice seed bead necklace, multi-stranded, pretty. All right, let's grab the rest and see if we can do it all right another another ring another ring like we had before rhinestones missing right here i can put some rhinestone the size is seven it's hammered gold tone with somewhere Oh, this one is very pretty. What is this? Something carved. Let me see. It seems like it seems like it's plastic, guys. Seems like this one is plastic. It's a bee or a moth or I don't know what this is. Necklace, gun metal color closure, long extender, lobster claw, gold tone. The size of this necklace is 16 inches, and then we have three and a half inch extender. Okay. A sand. Oh no, wood. This one's wood, probably Hawaiian kind of a necklace with flowers and a turtle. Uh, right here we have, oh, it needs to be fixed in the sense of like this came, came out. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Lobster claw, silver, silver tone, wooden necklace. Size is 18 inches. This one is plastic necklace. It's kind of swirly lavender and white plastic beads. Spring closure. No extender. Eighteen inches plastic ne necklace, like the per um, kind of a purple lavender swirls. Another ring, bron um, not bronzy, coppery color that I think at one point was gold tone with yellow plastic cabochon. Mm -hmm. Size 
eighth mm -hmm. copper ring. Let's take a look at this one, multi-stranded necklace, silver tone closure. We have an extender, we have faux pearls, some of them losing their coloring. Yeah, they're rubbing off, but it's still very pretty and very, how to say that is elegant. Oh, he's snoring. You probably guys can hear him snoring under my bed. Mm -hmm. uh, under my bed. His bed is under my table. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's very small. Without any extenders, it's 12 inches. And the extender is another 4. So it's 16 inch if you put it, put it like till the very end like this it's 16 inches okay there we go let's take a look at this necklace this one says a spring spring street right there spring street gold tone lobster claw with blue glass beads Nope, these are not glass, acrylic. And this this one's glass. Okay, Spring Street. Let's measure the length. So, oh my goodness. He snores like a sailor. Okay. So, right, these beads are not glass, and then it comes to the drop, V and the drop with this pendant, okay? Two-sided. Let's measure. Twenty-eight inches until the drop, three-inch extender, and the drop is four and a half. Here is another necklace with this very pretty um, accessory, faux pearls. Okay, two different, uh, three, two white uh, faux pearls and one kind of a silver tone. Yeah, faux pearls, three strands. Um, right here we have Something says right here. Let's take a look. Something like glued, like a paper, sticky paper. It says... Made in Taiwan. Manpo. Yeah, it says made in Taiwan. Three strands. They are all the same length. They are... 34 inches all um, each and right here we have like clothes in a very pretty rose as a design on it very pretty I don't know how to open it probably like oh, I have no idea how to open oh, right there here we go okay nice very great condition all right let's take a look at this right here we have a big cat's eye gold tone with a chain all around and a gold tone chain with extender and lobster claw closure it has a little like yuckiness needs to be washed it is 16 inches without extender it is two inch extender and a very pretty gold tone cat's eye pendant next another necklace I don't understand why closure is hanging right here, but these ones are faux pearls and it looks like they're going to be like a choker. The length of it, the longest one is 18 inches, the longest one, but the pearls are not the best quality and I have no idea. Oh, this one's probably, I don't know what this is. 
Okay, another silver tone necklace. It is Chico's. Yes, it is Chico's right here. It's one strand, silver tone beads, long extender. And then we have this acrylic beads. Right here, some of them are iridescent. Very pretty. Very pretty. The strand is... 30, 34 inches an extender is another 3 34 plus 3 inch extender Chico's necklace these beads are plastic and they have like a shimmer and iridescent to them a silver tone necklace where is oh, right here is a closure like this, no extender. We have some discs, hammered, hammered links, and this is some type of natural stone. I guess I'm gonna guess how light that is colored. Let's measure no extender, like I said, 24 inches. Okay, 24 Chico's necklace. Silver tone necklace with this glass. Oh, this one's actually some type of quartz. Yeah, this is some type of quartz. It might be colored. It needs to be washed. It's a little yucky, but it it is some type of quartz. Let me show you with color. Right here, you see color. Greenish bluish quartz pendant does have some weight to it. Um, the tag on this necklace says, Oh, it's a White House Black Market. Okay, White House Black Market. The chain is 34 inches, extender is three. All right, White House Black Market. This is kind of bluish greenish quartz oh this one's heavy necklace this might be glass this is old this one is vintage it says monet we have a monet necklace gold tone closure and this white beads are exceptional they are glass they are glass milk glass i would assume they are they do have some weight to them very nice very nice monet necklace 30 inches no extender oh, the weight is so nice all right let's take a look at this one um this one is is this avon let's see yeah we have Avon necklace, faux pearl um, cabochon with two rhinestones, a gold tone necklace, 17 inches, and a faux pearl teardrop pendant, Avon necklace. Gold tone necklace with a lobster claw with a gold tone cross and a rhinestone. The chain of, on this necklace is 20. I just don't understand why it's uh, like closes right here, but that's okay. Here is a cross. Stretchy bracelet. Stretch is tough, kind of. I think this one goes together with the, with the one we found in the beginning. Let me see if I can get to it. Yeah, I think this two, I think this two go together. Look at this. They look the same. Yeah, I think this two go together. Okay. Seven inches each. Yeah, this one we found at the beginning. This one we found right now. Oh, the rhinestone. Um... It says handmade, made in Italy. This one says handmade, made in Italy, Italy, and it says express right here. 
It's one strand, it's plastic, kind of a muted gold tone links and plastic beads. Yeah, they're all plastic and it just goes on like this with all these different beads. The length of this is 20, I'm sorry, 48. 48 Express made in Italy, maybe a vintage Express, but all the beads are plastic. Another bib style necklace, gunmetal color, no name. We have a lobster claw closure. We do have an extender. Let's see if I can untangle it. Let me see. Here we go. A glass. Sounds like glass. No, it's not glass. No, it's not glass. Let's see. No, not glass. Acrylic. They're black. Um, kind of rhinestones. Not glass. Gone metal color bib style like this. It's pretty, not in bad condition, right? All right, let's see. Let's see. We'll do like quick measure Rooney. 16 inches without and three inch extender. Bib style. Okay. This is a kind of industrial kind of like um nail bent nail i think um chain gold tone does have some weight to it lobster claw closure it does have extender like this see uh, links it's, it does have weight like i said 16 without extender and three and a half uh, three inches extender Chain. Oh, this is pretty. So we have a gold tone chain with a cross, and inside the cross we have rhinestones. Oh, they're so bright. They are CZs. Now let's see if there is anything on the closure. I don't see anything on the closure. Uh, I don't think there are any writings on the cross. Look at this uh, gorgeousness. There's something I think right here, but I... No. I, I don't see anything. I don't see anything. Oh, he is magnetic, chains magnetic lightly, but still very pretty. Look at this, so pretty. It's going to be shining. Chain is on the shorter side. It is 16 inches. Oh, pretty. Okay, right here we have a chain. This is looks like a silver chain. I don't have, I, I, I'm going to keep it for the pendants. That I usually sometimes find. Yeah, I can see it's Italy 924. I'll keep it. Um, right here we have another necklace. This one's heavy. It also says Express Gold Tone, Muted Gold Tone. It's, oi. It's heavy. It's solid. Two strands, two chains on this side, and then chunky chain right here. 16 inches without an extender, 2 inch extender. It's nice, kind of asymmetric, brutalist kind of style. And the last one we have, is it silver? I don't think so. I don't see any, any markings. No, I don't see any markings, but it's really pretty. Uh, we have sodalite, we have glass beads, like this one's uh, lapis, most likely this one's lapis, sodalite or lapis. No, they're all sodalite, this one. Uh, I mean, this is, this one's um, lapis, this one's sodalite right here. 
nice, interesting. Okay. Yeah, definitely, definitely natural with glass beads. Yeah, definitely natural. And we have an extender. I can I can test it. It might be silver. It's interesting. Hold on. Let, let me try since it's the last one. So this is extender. Like right here. And this is our closure. Closure is not silver, but extender is. Yeah, extender is silver. I can definitely see it. Yep, it's silver. Extender is. See? Yeah. Extender is silver. Closure is not. Okay, let's measure it. It is... Come on. It is... Huh, hold on. It's 15 inches and this is 1 inch, 16 inch necklace. Okay? All right, my friends, thank you so much. We are over an hour. Please forgive me. I love you all. I hope I did a good job. Please consider subscribing. Leave me thumbs up if you think I did a good job and leave me a comment and I will see you very, very soon. Bye.